first thing that I always do before putting on makeup is prepping my skin with a hydrating moisturizer and a little bit of eye cream. The next step is to prep your eyes and I really love this eye primer from Jane Iredell. It's called Canvas and I really love using it in the corner of my eyes as well as under the brow to give it a little bit of a brightening glow. I'm going to be using my new 100% pure eye palette. Um, it also has a nice blush in there as well. I'm going to start on the eyes with the lightest eyeshadow color. And this is my MAC number 239 and I'm going to use this to just pack on the color right onto the lid. And then in the corner of the eye as well. I'm using a bit of a darker shade right in the crease area to give my eye a little bit more depth and just make sure you blend this all the way. And then right under the eye. I'm going to go in now with this darker shade. I like this color because it has a bit of shimmer so I'm going to pack this on the lid. and again under the eye and now I'm using the darkest shade right in my crease to give more definition and depth to my eye I really love using a gel liner to make a cat eye I did struggle with this product a little bit at first to get the dark color that I was hoping for but I just had to warm up the product and, and eventually it did its thing I also just like to add a little bit of definition under the eye as well and we're gonna curl the lashes we're gonna put on some mascara this is the Zuzu mascara and if you want feel free to apply a pair of false eyelashes To fill in your brows, it's always important to go with your natural brow shape. And when I fill in my brows, I use the 100% pure gel. And I like to push the product up through the brow. I personally like a squared off look for the brow. So I tend to draw the line underneath and then again pull the product up. Sometimes if I like a darker look, I will use a brown eyeshadow to give the brow a little bit more definition. And that's what I'm doing right here. I won't go into too much detail about the foundation routine in this video. However, I will go over the products that I used. This is the Zuzu Face Primer. And of course my handy dandy Sappho Liquid Foundation. This is definitely my favorite foundation of all time. What's great about this product is that you can have a very sheer coverage or you can build it up and have a medium to heavy coverage. This is my 100% pure concealer. I like to use this under the eye to brighten up the area as well as on any blemishes just to cover them up and even out the skin tone. I'm using the eye primer from the beginning of the video because I absolutely love using it as a highlighter and my Revolution Glow Blush is really simple to use, especially when you're not wearing any powder on your face. And last but not least, we're gonna put on some lipstick. This is the 100% Pure Peach Lipstick. I am going crazy over this color and I'm super excited to wear it for spring. Okay, I have a huge problem when it comes to putting lip products on. I seriously just can't stop putting it on. Anyone else? Thank you all for sitting here for five minutes and watching my very first makeup video. I really appreciate it. If you guys would like to see more videos, I'm definitely open to doing more. 
And if you would like to learn about toxin-free cosmetics, please visit me at beautyreawakened.com.